Hey guys, I am back. I am doing a recap video for the people who missed the live at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is a recap live. So I'm going to premiere it so you guys won't miss a beat. Hey guys, so the likelihood of Queen Op going live today is slim to none. And I'm going to show you uh, right now. Hey, Genty. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. So a few hours ago, she had put up this new private uh, page. And I find it to be hilarious because she said the last page that she uh, put up was going to be the last page. But I find that, which makes a lot of common sense, people panic thinking that, oh, she put up a new private page. I'm going to miss the page. I mean, the lives, so I got to, you know, um, pay for whatever she's charging for the page. We know she's charged up to $20. So 5 and 10 ain't nothing compared to what people have been ripped off for. So that ain't nothing. Hey, Tammy, new member, new member. Hey, Scorpio. Hello, everyone. Hello, SL Davis. How you doing, sweetie? Um, But... She's not going to go live today unless she's going to go live on a page that has already been established, whether it's an established private page or her main page, which is not, um, you know, private. Me, personally, I would go on the um, public page where she'll get more viewers and she can um, advertise she started a new page to get these numbers up. Because as you guys see, these numbers are in zero. Zero posts, zero followers, and zero following. And let me show you something else. When I go in and look up this page, there's already an impersonation page. And the impersonation page, well, that's why God don't like ugly, has already made $170. They have it on private. They have last private live page. I'm making ten dollars to get in Queen Op Goat, but they have a zero set of an O and a um, two T's and a one. Um, put your Instagram name in in the four section. So they basically duplicated Queen Op's page, but put a, a different uh, profile picture. Um, and if you are not familiar with Queen Op's Cash App. You know, you, you might know it's Queen Op Goat. It might be spelled that way. So whoever um, signed up for this private page here, they think that this is the real page. But the real page is spelled with uh, one Y. It's Queen Op Dirty with one Y. So somebody's already trying to um, steal the spotlight already and cash in off of uh, Queen Op. But you know what, though? God don't like ugly and they ain't fond of beauty. And the reason why I say that is because Queen Op is so busy playing mind games behind the scenes with people. She's not making it known um, these pages are her pages and, and, and their scam pages um, take her coins. She doesn't have time to do it because anybody with, hi, sweetie, anybody with sense would, I'm, I'm going to answer all the, um, I'm going to read all the comments in a minute. Um, hey, um, I mean, Hartwell, if she had any sense, she would be posting stories on that new private page. She would probably do short lives on that private page, even if it's 60 seconds. So, and maybe keep some, some of them up so that we know that it's her active page. She just had Danny put together a page and, and right after she did that, Somebody else came up with a page with the same name, too. Now, I put inside of the poll, uh, would you guys like to um, hear me do a uh, commentary on Chris Sean? And the reason, uh, uh, you know, which made me uh, bring that up was because I don't know if that's going to uh, crack the whip on, um, you know, uh, Queen Op because she seems to have a jealousy. Um, you know, for uh, Chris, uh, you know, uh, Krishan for no reason, because I, I have not yet to see Krishan in her mouth. 
you know, I think that uh, Queen Op is jealous of the fact she's a celebrity. She has a celebrity uh, baby's father. They both have a little bit of money. You know what I'm saying? And they're in the spotlight, and they don't have to try hard for clout because they get it because of the, the job that they have. Um, and I, I wanted to add Chris John to the equation one, because I want, hopefully, you know, if I'm consistent, Chris John come across these videos, um, especially when Queen Op is putting her little one in her mouth and hopefully Chris John responds eventually. Even if she responds one time, I, I think she really needs to G check Queen Op. She's a little bit beside herself. Now I was kind of shocked at the response response that I had got um, with this uh, post that I had put up. I didn't think that uh, anybody would uh, even respond to it, but they did. So let me see something real quick. I'm going to share this uh, poll that I put up. And we need to add, you know what I'm saying, more uh, content of other uh you know, uh, social media influences, especially ones that are in their bag, especially ones that, you know, Queen Op is probably talking mess on them, but they're putting in the work that they need to put in so that they're not out here scamming and scheming their supporters. You feel what I'm saying? So within the time that I had put this poll up, um, which I was quite impressed of the um, the votes, that was 50 minutes ago. It got 93 votes. 67 people said um, they would like for me to put Chris Sean on um, the, the uh, you know, channel. And 33 said, you know, they would like me to have Queen Op. I'm not getting rid of uh, Queen Flop. So don't worry about that. Make sure y'all hit the like button on the way in. But I want to also add more... Um, people, you know what I'm saying, to the channel besides just Queen Op because Queen Op is cornball. Um, and I really feel like maybe this will push her more to stop talking about people and, and, and be about it. Michelle's gone. We get that you're lazy. You have no drive. Then you have a fiend who you have to babysit alongside with a little one. We get it. Now you're both drinking, so now, you know, your supporters have to pay for your habits alongside with uh, alleged canned milk for the baby and all this other stuff that you are trying to beg for money for. So, you know, I really hope that these supporters this time around, they stick to their guns and they do not, um, you know, um, put any money on that private live. IG page that she just opened up only because I would make her work for it. Work for it first. Go live on your free page, your main page. Make your presence known. Work for your cash and then I can respectfully see within maybe 24 hour time from the time that you open up your page you know the uh, I mean well the main page and go live. Then I can see you saying you know this is what I'm charging if you want to pay that for um you know my new private page make her work for it hey creative how you doing hey marcus is that marcus oh child no that's not even marcus i need my reading glasses hey mm it says is this a live live i'd be confused talking to myself in the chat i no, this is live what i've been doing sis is after these lives play so that if people um, miss the lives and they don't want to look at it while it's not live anymore, I, I do a premiere video to the live. So you can see it all over again if you came in the live in the beginning or the middle or the end and you didn't see it all, you can watch it in a premiere. So I always put recap. You'll always hear me put recap. Yeah, you'll always hear me put recap at the beginning of a live that I did from today or two days ago. But I do that so that people can um, see the live in the premiere um, format 
but they're more inclined to look at the uh, live premiere over again if they didn't see the whole live because it's live. And then they can interact with the chat, you know, people in the chat. So that's why I do it like that. It was a suggestion someone had gave me, a few people, and I said, that's a good idea. So I do a recap live after this live is over. When in the live chat, what? RN. is definitely a live live. No, this is a live. This is the live MM. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying everybody's name. Baby, Litta, Litta, what is it? Litta 22? Yeah, this is live. She's trolling by putting Jaden Alex song and lyrics on her post. She's trying to get a reaction out of Chris Rock. Christine, I said Chris Rock. Uh, <laughs> Krishan Rock. She, um, she needs a new storyline. And that's right. So I'm giving her what she wants, Hartwell. That's one of the main reasons I'm going to add um, Krishan to the roster. Because we're going to make her have to get under that rock she climbed under. And we, we, want, we want that competition factor to, um, to play. play. We, want, we, want, we want her to be on the clout chasing queen up. And we also want to see how much of a fool she's going to make of herself in, in doing so. So there's a method to my madness. And I know just like people tune in to hear me talk about Queen Op, Queen Op's going to tune in to hear me talking about, uh, you know what I'm saying, Krishan. So you know what I'm saying? It's called reverse psychology. And Queen Op is good at playing reverse psychology. So, hey, let's play it. But the difference between me and you, Queen Op, is I'm going to tell you that's what I'm playing with you. You feel what I'm saying? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to make her crawl from underneath that rock. And when she sees the spotlight is no longer on her completely, she's going to want to do the right thing. And that is if your supporters pay to see it says no call. She needs chill. Rock will rock her. Exactly. We already know that. But see, that will be commentary. You see what I'm saying, sis? And she needs to meet her match. Queen Op needs to meet her match. She got this girl all in her mouth. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have Queen Op come out of hiding, and we're gonna put, um, you know. Blue faces baby's mother in the equation. Chris Sean. And we're going to make her have to do some work. And anytime she mentions Chris um, Sean's baby again, we're going to do commentary on that. And even when she's not mentioning Chris Sean's little one, we're going to be talking about Chris Sean. That's going to take the spotlight off a of queen a little bit. It's going to it's going to want to make her get her clout back that she so called thinks that she has. My god clout, which doesn't equal up to no money, but she loves the word clout. Clout clout clout. Make sure as y'all come in you hit the like button please. Cap. Exactly. It says Yeah, you feel what I'm saying? So there's a method to my madness of what I'm doing. I want to see how Queen, uh, Queen Op's going to respond. But anyways, back to what I was saying. Don't disappoint yourself in thinking that uh, she's going to go uh, live today. If she does go live, that's probably because she wants to prove anyone, including myself, that she uh, is going to go live, whether she gets people to sign up to the new page or not. So, you know, we'll see. But like I said, Red flags that she's running game is when she says that she um, needs us to sign up for these private pages, but she never tells you a time and a date when she's going to go live. That's because, hey, she keeps it real a little bit. Why give you a time when her intentions is not to go live? She's just trying to get up the bag. Now, do you realize if a, if a thousand people within the next 72 hours, because that's about... a that's about um, enough 
um, followers for her to be able to go live. She did that on the other page, and I'll show you that in a minute. I think it's 1,114 followers on the private page. But if you real if you realize in 72 hours, if she can manage to get a thousand people to sign up on that new page, that's ten thousand dollars. So you're taking a risk paying up front for the um private um page that she just created. Because if she does reach that goal within 72 hours, which is very possible for her to do, she's not gonna need to go live. She got the money up front. I'm quite sure she's going to budget it, you know, and, and, and Queen Op way budget it, where she can, you know, be okay for a hot little second. She ain't got to go live. She got the money. She already got the bread. And she'll go live on her terms. And that's what she's been doing. She's been stacking up the bread and going live on her terms. Anytime she ever really said she was going live, it, it was always a lie. So I, I think that you guys should pay her after you see her go live for free. Let her say out of her mouth on a live that she started a new page and that is $10. Let her put in some sort of work before you pay that $10 all over again, 5 to $10 all over again. And then she jam scams you. Now I'm just saying it because it, it, it's sad. It don't make no sense. It makes us all look bad as content creators, when you have somebody doing that. Because, you know, sometimes people stereotype. They think, well, she's doing it, they're all doing it. And and that's farther from the truth. You know what I'm saying? And one bad apple spoils it for the bunch. And that's exactly what she's doing. She's spoiling it for people that do work hard. They're not trying to um, bamboozle people. You know, and I think that's dead wrong. I really think it's dead wrong. You know, so sometimes people got to wake up, smell the coffee um, and, and stop, you know, falling for the okie doke because that's all it is, is okie doke. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I can't see her going live today, guys. So for any of you supporters that are in the bushes um, that you're probably mad I'm saying this, stone salt on your supporter. I'm just telling you the real for deal. OK. And that's all to it. Now, if you want to, just like the um troll page did, wait around. You know what I'm saying? Like the troll page. That troll page ain't going live because that's not even the right page. The troll page got 17 followers on a private page. So that means somebody sent to that fake um goat, uh, what is it, queen op goat um cash app. 17 people already sent seven, um, 17 payments, which is $10 per payment. They've already made $170. And the real page that Queen Up put together, they made zero followers and $0. See, God don't like ugly. Now, I know Queen got an issue with the fact somebody just scooped in right after she created a page. Well, Danny created it and swindled her like that. Well, see, you can't always be the one swindling and not expecting to get swindled back. It's called even swap, no swindle. But you know what? Hey, don't hate the play, hate the game. Because you, 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 um, you playing the game and you don't want no one to hate on you. So you can't get mad when it's done to you. Op could have been in the same thing. She messed up her, yep, opportunity, her baddie opportunity. Because nobody wants, to deal with somebody that ratchet because be, I'm going to be honest with you. Some of them baddie chicks. Yeah. You know, they, they're pretty girls and you know, they get into like drama or whatever, but there's an element to all TV programs like that where they add extra drama to sensationalize it. Queen op already comes with the sensationalized drama. It's out of control and it could be bad for business. She doesn't know how to adapt. She doesn't know how to be this way at this time and this way when it comes to business. She had the same opportunities, exactly. It's Krishan. Krishan, she didn't wait around for it. And she 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 didn't um, expect no one to give it to her. She went out and got it. Queen Op, she thinks she's so gorgeous, people are supposed to just give it to her. It don't work like that. 
That's why she's out here doing what she's doing to people. Because she's playing catch-up, believe it or not. She's playing catch-up, Queen Op is. Because she's not a hustler like she makes herself out to be. The clout ain't there like she makes that out to be. And she ain't getting that bag like, like, like she makes it out to be. And it's because the person who used to help her get that money is gone. So she's a flop. Now, if Rock sees her out, that's the difference to, oh, you already know. You already know. I actually sent it to her and her sister. You actually sent what, um, Daniel, with three grandkids? Yeah, so, you know. Krishan would only be giving her clout. She should ignore her. No, but I'm just saying, this is entertainment. That's all we should look at it. Look at it like, you know, you know, and no offense to you, but sometimes, you know, when people say, you know, you're giving that person clout, they're really worried about you're giving that person money in their pocket. Who cares? You can get up here and, and maybe it might not be about social media influencers, but you can get up here and if you like to, you like to crochet or knit and you have, there's an audience for it, you can make money too and be the, the top knitting and crochet channel they are all channels in competition with each other commentary channels too and the way they make money is they have to have commentary there's no commentary there's nothing to talk about now we 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 really want somebody that got all bark no bite which is queen op to have somebody like um krishan come into the equation and clown her like she clowns her supporters and clowns Krishan's baby and Krishan and everybody else she can. I really want to see how she moves if Krishan even responded to her clown behind. That's what I want to see. Are you going to have that same energy? That's all. To me, that's fun. Just like she thinks it's fun when everybody else is the butt of the joke. Why can't people think it's fun for her being the butt of the joke? Everybody gets a turn. She's not above life's, life's classroom. She's not above life's classroom at all. Everybody can take one for the team sometime. You know what I'm saying? It says, yep, Danny's the nanny. <laughs> right, exactly. Yes, make sure y'all hit that like button when you come in. Let's try to get the likes up to at least 100 because they look like they're on a diet today for some reason. There's almost 200 people in here. She's not um, going to do that. That's too much, like, right for her. Yes, my friend. I want to see it happen. Even if it happens one time, like I said, I want to see – I want to see – uh, Krishan dog walk queen up one good time. I don't care what nobody says. I want to see a dog walk a one good time. And I know you guys want to see it too. She dog walks everybody else. <laughs> now that would be something to talk about. Because I know Krishan would go in on her. Like I said, Krishan is a, is is a superstar compared to to uh, Queen Op. Queen Op is she's a nobody. But if she dog walked her one good time, you know it will go viral because there's all type of um outlets that are talking about how she been you know disrespecting Krishan's child. So everybody will be reporting on it. Krishan would be even more viral than she already is. And then maybe, who knows? It might be the opposite. Maybe then Queen Aunt will be so embarrassed, even to walk the streets, she might go into hiding and shut her mouth for a little while. She just made a new page. I know, it's right here. It's on the screen right now, Amber. Portwood. It's called Queen Op Dirty with one Y. The reason why I knew that this was the page was because I clicked on the story. And um, it redirected me to the page. That's how I know that this other page with the with the uh, double Y, it's a fake troll page. But the fake troll page 
is getting money off off Queen because she hasn't she she either hasn't added the followers yet. Um, but I know that the fake page has gained 17 followers since Queen Op putting up her page, which is the real page. So I cannot believe Taylor Port. Danny said the doctor knocked out her teeth. Oh, come on. Because she couldn't breathe. She sound oh my god. Oh my goodness. For real. I wait a minute. I cannot believe Teleport Danny said the doctor knocked out her teeth because she couldn't breathe. She sound yeah. No, your teeth got knocked out from the substance you were smoking. Oh my god, I can't believe that. That is crazy. Hey, Susan, how are you, sweetie? Somebody get security. I think I'm going to need some backup. That would be something Rock the... Uh, but I don't think Rock would give her the time of the day now. Probably not. I just want to see it happen one time. Now, do I think that uh, Krishan would go back and forth with her every single day? No. No. She'd do a Nicki Minaj real quick on her. And keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? She'll do a Nicki Minaj on her. Speak her piece. And keep it moving. You know? Or who knows? She could do like a, a Cardi B. And uh, I'm being funny. I, I, I know she wouldn't take it to this level. But I'm saying she could do a Cardi B. And take it in the court. But she wouldn't get no money from um the clout chaser. um Queen up. Because she ain't got a bag to give... uh. Krishan, uh, you know, money for character assassinating her. She's broke as a broke down stove. That's why she's robbing her supporters. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Brilliant stuff, SO. Yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get that little weasel from underneath that rock. Hi, new to the chat. Hi, Queen. Welcome, sweetie. I'm trying to weasel her out of underneath that rock. Hey, it's me, Candy. Trying to weasel her out of that rock. Yes. C crawl from under that rock. Krishan's baby had surgery today. Pray up. Yeah, I know. Poor little thing. You're going to be so cranky. Wake that up. Hey, Tamika. What's up, sis? Wake it up. Wake it up. Yeah, he did. You know, he gonna be all right. He's definitely gonna be all right. But um, yeah. So I just, I just hope that everyone that's in this live here understands how it's really important not to pay for that new page. Make her do some work first. She tricks. So how could she possibly know who the father is? This ain't no duck, duck, goose game. Right, exactly. Right, exactly. Duck, duck, goose. Mm -hmm. It's you. You're the father. So aren't they both supposed to be recovered addicts? They are both going to be right back to it. They already are back to it. They are already back to it. She said it herself. The, what was it, two days ago she said she was going live and her and her wife were going to have some drinks and get tore up? That's when we assumed that maybe Juju took the baby for the weekend. I'm going to look on his Facebook page, too, now that I brought him up. Because if he did get the baby for the weekend, uh, he may have put some pictures on his own page. She's on a new account. Yep, a new account. But what's new? She's always on a new account. Always on the new account. It says it might be the trick or treat her that she was arguing with that wanted his money back. It could be because he's a regular. Yep, Candy. They both uh, non-recovered. Recovered. Uh, yeah. Remember she said she thought she gave him. Yep, an STD. So that means they aren't used. Right, that's my whole point. Not at all. But no, but she was she was very transparent about that, though. That uh, there's some people that she has been with and she has not used protection. So, you know, that is no surprise to me that um, 
she, you know, could have perhaps got something. Hold on one second. I want to put something in 395, 347. Okay, 395, 347. This should be good. Yeah, so it's no surprise to me about that. Skip that. She's always telling people, um, uh, remind me that I have to take my medication, guys, when she was on Big O. Like it was cute. You know, and, and you and you're literally this way because of the simple fact that you are not using protection with strangers. Okay, they might pay you a little bit more money for the pleasure, but it's not worth your health. Poor Summit is going to be on the floor while both of them <laughs> nodding off. Yeah, that is scary. She never is going to stop. Yep, that's just in her. The heart breaks for that little baby girl surrounded by those fools. Yep. And, you know, and, and that's funny you said that because I really feel like the only time I feel like, um, what's the name? Uh, uh, What's the name? Um, I, I feel like the only time that Danny cares about, you know, being in Little Summer's life and being, you know, nurturing is when she's sober. And that's not that often. The baby's only been in this world for like, what, two weeks and she's back drinking. Now it's like, uh, Summer? What's Summer? Summer who? Maybe it's um, Shell's cousin. She's been quiet. Could have made the page. Who knows? I don't know. No, it, it, uh, you're talking about the, the troll page? Diane, Cat. Anybody could have made that troll page, but whoever made that troll page, all I can tell you is that they got uh, 17 followers, and it's a private page, so they had to have cash app, that fake cash app, Cause that's not that's not Queen Queen Ops uh, Cash App, so they must have um they must have uh you know what I'm saying uh put up that Cash App which is not Queen Ops Cash App and people had Cash App the ten dollars and they got seventeen followers on that uh on the fake page already and this was right after um Queen Op had announced that hers was up her smile reminds me of a Macy's Gray's teeth. <laughs> Macy Gray's teeth. Mm-mm. St uh, Queen Ops in uh, Phil Philly. Yep. Hey, SL David Chat. Hey, Renee Williams. How are you, sweetie? She's in PA. Yep, PA. That part. You know what I'm saying, Danny? Yeah, so we'll see how it works out. You know, you know, Queen Op being the bushes, she be hearing what's going on and what content creators are saying. What about her? So she'll she'll probably um, start squawking about somebody is impersonating her page. That ain't her cash app. So forth and so forth and so forth. And um, she'll make it known. So she, you know, she ain't she ain't gonna want nobody stealing her her bread. I sent them the blog. She made talking about christina's baby yeah like like which i which i agree with you guys uh chris uh chris sean is is somewhere else in her life you know she's making music she's making money she just bought a house she just had a a, a baby who even if she's not with the baby's father blue face baby's taken care of for a lifetime there's no comparison you know, when you talk about uh, Queen Op and, and uh, Krishan. So you're right. She may never respond to, um, you know, uh, Queen Op. Because to Krishan, she's probably a nobody. She's going to keep digging her grave and rock. She's going to walk right over it. Yep. Yep. Like Krishan kids. Exactly. One by one. Queen Op is garbage. <laughs> Baby laying on the floor and talking about her um, mystery baby. Yeah. Well, a lot of people are saying that she got a bed that was just a money grab. She just put the blanket on the floor to make people feel sorry for her and want to uh, have her supporters.
fire a bed. I don't know how true it is. I'm not there with those fools. But um, that's what's being said, so I don't know. That's what's being said. And, I mean, it could be it could be some truth to it. I don't think she went. She might have the bed in storage. Who knows? She just didn't get it yet, you know? Danny started back drinking. You can't leave um a little summer in, in the house with her, you know, if she got to go take care of business so she can, you know, furnish the house, get the furniture that might be in storage out. You know, one of them got to be there with the baby. And if 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 uh Danny's drinking the teleport, she's not gonna leave the baby in the house just to go do all that. So she was better off telling Danny, you can't drink while you're in my house, and if you drink, you gotta go. Not this I gave her permission. All you did was open up another can of worms. A rock would be he hero. Take out up respectfully. Krishan's not going to let her get by talking about her baby like that. Op must did see how Krishan washed dishes with the girl that disrespected her before. Let me tell you something. Op ain't got no position or no right to be talking about nobody doing nothing. You sitting up there doing an IG story, washing baby's clothes in dirty water. Because that's not how you wash. I'm sorry. That's back in the day. There's washing machines now, okay? And what happened to her portable washing machine? I could see her using that portable washing machine before the one she got right now. She didn't lost her whole mind. Ain't no fun when the rabbits got the gun. Exactly. That was unreal, Danny. Mm-hmm. Washing the baby's clothes in the sink. And they, they don't get washed like that. I could see if it was like maybe... Two or three articles of clothes, baby clothes, and maybe some some um, bibs or something. But you can't wash no whole load of clothes in no sink and think it's gonna get all the 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 stuff out of the clothes. No, you gotta take that stuff to the washing machine. Yep, she said when they put the thing in her throat so she could breathe. Her sister said that also. Yeah, okay. That's her sister. You heard you heard what you said? It's her, her sister said that also. <laughs> she would molly wop Danny too. <laughs> SL is brutal, LOL. But truth. I try to keep the truth, tell the truth, and shame the devil, Danny. A tube isn't going to knock them out. Not the whole, not the whole top. Nah, that looks like somebody on some serious, serious drugs. I'm just waiting for her downfall. I'll let the Kool-Aid drinkers pay. Da I know exactly. Drink the Kool-Aid. Right, those people. Danny um, being groomed and can't see it. Exactly. Op has set herself up a losing battle every time she logs on action and talking. I can't wait. Yeah, it's about to, it's about to pop off. Hey, Lady T, I'm trying to see. Krishan's dog walker, dog walker, too. But you know, Op so delusional. She'll claim she won't. She won the fight. Yeah, I don't. Huh. She probably can't bust a grape in a fruit fight. She probably can't bust a grape. She probably thinks she can fight because she's been putting hands on Michelle for fifteen years. So she thinks she's tough because how she was handling Michelle. I mean, come on, you handling someone that. Never got into a fight a day in their life. And all you did was bully that poor girl. <sighs> Let me not say that word on here. She was on live when she was getting ready to take him to the hospital. <laughs> did Juju sign the birth certificate? Well, I think that he did, but I remember she said when she was in the hospital, she said, if you feel like... This is not your baby. Don't sign it. So, so uh, I didn't hear her say anything after that that he didn't sign it. So I'm figuring that he did, but I'm just guessing. It says I would pay her anything. Someone will screenshot the upload. Of course, that's why people don't need even pay for the um private live. It's gonna be somebody that's gonna um pay for it and record it. Ugh. 
that's what Op said, but he had doubts it was his. Another story, who knows? That to me was always weird with, with those two because at first when he came around in the picture, he acted like he was scared for a woman to even touch him, let alone Queen Op. And then I don't know how they got into an intimate relationship. I mean, this dude wears wigs and, and makeup and women's clothes. And she, uh, I don't know, to each his own. That's all I'm going to say. Hello, Robin. How are you, sweetie? He's probably going, I mean, doing his own in the Dukiana situation. I didn't hear about Op to a while ago. Well, it, it, it came about that they were supposed to be doing storylines together. But then people started saying that they became, like, intimate. So, yeah, Dukiana did say, from my understanding, that he was claiming a baby at one point in time. So if you were claiming a baby at one point in time before y'all had a fallout, that meant you guys were, you know, intimate some, some time after you moved in there for uh, a couple of months. And I could never get that relationship. I really couldn't. They they were more like, you know, girls at a slumber party than in a, a, a relationship. But apparently they were more than just, you know, um doing storylines, you know, you know, Queen Op was doing the do with them. <clears throat> so that's why a lot of people were saying it could have been his or could have been Juju's. But after they broke up, he had said it wasn't. So I don't know. I seen one, but not where she is now. Yeah, so she must have took it back. She went to Target, then walked to see if Danny would pay for it. That was funny as heck. For uh, Danny came out and asked her, what is going on? I think that was all a setup to get more money. <clears throat> no. Danny played her. Period, point blank. We ain't going to give her no credit. It's me, Candy. She was she was clowning Danny, walking out that store, laughing, talking about. I found out uh, about somebody's cash app, and she basically was like, "And she gonna pay for these clothes?" <clears throat> Danny left the clothes and the carriage in there, came out, and and Queen Op was looking stupid, cause she thought she was gonna pay for them clothes. Does Danny have her own account? Well, apparently, um, Queen Op allegedly said she found out about a cash app. So all that time she was supporting Danny with um buying her liquor and weed and cigarettes and all that stuff. She found out later on, which was about, what, a month before she had the baby, that she has a cash app. And it has money on it. So. Says Queen Op is still broke. Right. You already know. Krishan won't have to say anything. Her older sister will go in. You already know. Definitely no um, competition. You already know. I can't believe she had Summer on that dirty floor. <laughs> I can believe it. <clears throat> Somebody has said, I didn't hear her say it. She was complaining about there being dust mites on the floor. So when, when I heard somebody say it, I can't remember who had said it to me. I didn't hear it, so I, I can't run with it. But if there are dust mites on that floor, you know how we can itch if dust mites get on us. Um, I don't see how she has a little one on the floor like that. He said, Queen Op is an EBT hustler. Oh, man, you are funny. Yeah, she got a bed. She's a scammer. Yeah, I think she does, too. Even if it's not at the apartment, she probably got it in storage. She didn't go live yet taking these people's money. Yep. Taking these people's money. Talk about that. Let me refresh this page. Maybe she is adding as we talk. Nah, she hasn't added anybody. The only thing gets me about, you know, this, you know, send you $10 and send the $10 and for what? You ain't going live today. You're just taking these people's money. Come on, let's try to get the um likes up to at least 150. It's not adding up. It's almost 300 people in here. Wow. Says Danny's broke and inherited the the Usher. Says they didn't buy that baby nothing but some onesies. That's all I see too. 
And I don't think, I don't care what nobody says, I don't think she even got a bassinet. She said she was going to put one of the bassinets at Juju's house and keep one of them. I ain't seen that baby in a bassinet yet. So Sierra has money to buy a bottle of liquor, but not wash her baby's clothes. That's just sickening. I mean, when I seen that, I said, come on with the old school washing baby's clothes. You know what I'm saying? Come on with all that. You doing the most. She's doing the most. Queen back drinking too. Yep. That's what she said. In one breath asking for wig money and milk money. Yeah, it's like, I mean, which which one is really important to you? Which one should be really important to you is the question. I guess the wig, because she sure enough spent a lot of money on a wig, and then uh, Danny turns around and messed it up. What is teleport? Somebody help me out. I never heard of it. Now, the teleport, I know they might make hard liquor, but it's wine. It's like a sweet wine. Some, some, some people call it a dessert wine. I've had it before. You know, I, I like it chilled more than warm. When you drink it warm, it tastes, tastes funny. But I've had it before. It's not that bad because it don't have that bitter, like how some wines or, or Chardonnays are. It's almost like a dessert wine, a sweet wine. She probably sold it. <laughs> Who knows, right? Oh, but if rocks, which will never run into garbage like art, uh, she ain't going to be nowhere to be running. She going to be in a limo or, or one of them cars that you only see in car shows. Um, Krishan is. She ain't thinking about no queen op. She ain't running in no circle that queen op is running in at all. Krishan literally put a girl in the kitchen sink and wore her out. Woo woo. Or her little self. Poor baby going to be broke out. Yeah. From the um from the dust mites. You know? <clears throat> She's just nasty. I, it was so funny when I when I was looking at the comment section, somebody had said, and I know she ain't washing them clothes in that sink. That's so dirty. I mean, she took it way back. I wouldn't even have showed nothing like that. That just goes to show how lazy Queen is. You mean to tell me you couldn't take the time out? I'm quite sure there's a laundromat around there somewhere. And they would it wouldn't even have taken maybe about an hour to wash all them clothes and dry them. They're little baby clothes. That's just being lazy. I don't care what nobody says. You choose a place with no laundry. That's your fault. Then you said he's a slumlord, but you only been there five seconds. Exactly. Miss Beautiful. <laughs> it's crazy. That just don't make no sense. I think maybe she is is in efficiency. I don't know. She got a lot of stuff not right with her. Mean op is scared. Yeah, she might. I thought of that too, but still, you know, maybe you need to keep your mouth closed because there's things that you have to do right now. One of them is wash your child's clothes. Queen op fumbled the bag. Yep, that's Michelle's gone. Michelle was the star of the show, and that's why I think she didn't like Michelle. She knew that Michelle was the star of the show, and she didn't like the fact that um, it ended up that way. She thought that Michelle was the ugly duck, duckling. She was the, the, the princess, you know, queen up. And she thought she was going to get all the shine and make Michelle the butt of the joke, but get all the shine to the point where even if Michelle wasn't around, she would still get the shine. But it didn't happen like that. When the shine went away, which was Michelle, Arp, I mean, Michelle, Arp, which was Michelle. The shine went away. She ain't got nothing to talk about. She ain't got nobody to clown. She attempts to do it with Danny. Danny be ready to go upside ahead. So talk about it. Is it really worth it at the end of the day? No. SL, have you ever seen Queen Op Twitter's account? You will throw up. Yeah, I seen it. She be having all kind of crazy stuff up on there. She said he didn't sign it. Oh, oh that's what happened? I thought he did. Hey, I love your work. Well, thank you, Olivia. Well, if he didn't sign it, I don't know why she's going around saying that's the baby's father. Because that's a clear, because he did go up to the hospital. That's a clear sign he got doubts. He don't think it's the baby. He's the baby's father. 
did he sleep with all I, hmm. right? Why do Pop look like Shelly? She has stronger genes. I pray that they don't have that baby smelling like, <laughs> look at meth. Oh, my Lord. No, you didn't. Oh, my God. I'm on the floor with that. Witty. Oh, no, you didn't. I can't wait for her court date. That's, um, she goes to court October 13th, guys. October 13th, which is in 11 days. Queen tried to get with Duke, but Duke don't like women. He was creeped out. That's what I had said. That's why I don't understand how that happened. That he was saying that he was the baby's father until they broke up. Had like a mental breakdown after being with her. It brought up his past. Wow. Yeah, you know what? I believe that too, that he had a breakdown because I remember that time when he was on, I, I showed you guys the video too. He was talking about, um, that's Queen's page. His page, he was saying, was Queen's page. That's Queen's page. Um, She's my manager and she manages that, that, that page. That is Queen's page. I said to myself, you know what? Something ain't right with him. That is your page, dude. Stop saying Pop's page. And she was um yelling at him in a live, telling him to get his mother out the house. So I said, that boy didn't lost all his faculties. Queen is a switch for real. She likes men, women, trans studs. She just gets off on power at the end of... Yep. Tezzy said, yes, Duke went through something. Being Yeah. You, so you can imagine what Michelle's going through. Queen's trying to use rock for clout to keep us talking about her. She knows she can't rock with. Yeah, but that's gonna run out because we already we already see that um Queen Op ain't doing it like she thinks she's doing it. We already know who kept her relevant, and that's Michelle. So the gig's up. And while she plays patty cake, patty cake baker's man behind the scenes, and don't get out here and make no bread. Like, stop taking supporters' money and really put in the work that you promised your supporters. That's going to run out, too. He had a panic attack for days after their encounter. I bet he did. Nah, Queen was already pregnant when Duke came around. I believe it. Exactly played. So. That's sad, though. When somebody brings you to, to that point. Yeah, because she's got to get paid from doing caregiver thing with her mom so she's got to have a CA or some type of account it's fun when Danny says she's been saving yeah right saving what liquor bottles I'm so confused I thought Dukiana's like men yeah he does that's why I was confused he got around uh Queen Op and she she confused him even more <laughs> how about that I know nothing about that story but would like to well, I'll do more videos on it. I do have a couple of stories. She's so slow. She shouldn't should have stuck to her music instead of the stuff she did to show. She has talent but won't use it. Yeah. That's sad. The baby should be her main focus, not a relationship. Exactly. She was drinking with Dukiana saying she can drink because she did way worse with her other pregnancies. And it's nothing in comparison. Yeah, because she said she was on the drugs and stuff like that. <clears throat> yep. That's why she felt like the doctors were making her suffer when she kept going to the hospital. When she was having a lot of um, labor pains, she said because they, you know, they found drugs in her system. So, you know, they probably looked down on her like, how dare you be a mother pregnant with a child and have this in your system? So she said she felt like they, the hospitals were making her suffer. Claimed she paid over 500 to clean the car. Yeah, right. Yeah, please. She's probably scamming right now. Yeah, she is. She just, this page that we're looking at right now, the Queen Op Dirty. That's the new page right there she's trying to get money off of. Because she needs money so she can scam the people. Well, listen, guys, I'm not going to be on here too long. I just wanted to tune in. I will definitely be on tomorrow uh between four five and six depending on you know when the traffic comes in um 
but I just want to, you know, daily do a daily update. And especially if there's something really popping off, you know, I'm going to get up on here and do a live with y'all. Make sure that you hit the like button on the way out. And I will see you in the next live stream. Love y'all. Stay blessed. And I'm out. Mwah.